Hey you guys, um, I'm just gonna do, um, like a real quick update on myself. Today I had my gallstone surgery, and, um, this video is regarding gallstone surgery, um, also slash, um, breastfeeding. I'm gonna do this real quick, like, I don't know why I have the energy to, because I, like, need some help. Um, you guys know that I breastfeed Lanaya, and... Um, for these past few days before my surgery, I pumped and stole my milk. So I've been trying to get her to drink out of her bottles. Um, I use a Modella pump, and her bottles, the, um, I use, sorry, like I'm saying, um, I'm still kind of out there for surgery. Um, I use, um, the bottles from Playtex. I don't, I don't have the nipples here to show you, but it's not the old school one where the, where the nipple around it is kind of inverted, like in. It's not those kind. Um, if you guys want to see what they look like, just let me know if, you know, if you want to help or whatever. Just let me know. Let's get up. Just let me know if you guys want to see it. Whatever. If you guys want to see it, I'll make another video, like, five seconds showing you what the bottle looks like. But I'm having problems with Lanaya taking those bottles. She will not drink from those bottles. Um, as far as when I put apple juice and purified water into a, a bottle, um, it's a different kind of nipple. She'll drink that if she's really thirsty. But as far as um, breast milk out of a Playtex bottle, she won't drink. She will not drink it. So I've been giving her, um, I've been feeding her baby food, uh, some applesauce, and I'm gonna, she doesn't really like any baby food, so that's a plus with her, you know, trying baby food, but I've been trying to give her baby food, well, of course her daddy and my cousin, he's here helping also, um, she's been taking her applesauce, and she's been, um, it's Cheerios, multigrain, as well as drinking her apple juice, like I said, and I think I'm going to give her some, um, uh, what is that stuff called? Um, um, I can't think what it's called. I can't think to straight, you know. Um, it's, it's like, uh, almost like flavored water, but it's, uh, what they give you when the baby's dehydrated. I can't think of it right now. She has two of those, um, you know, let me know if I should give her that. Um, that's really it, what I can think of. And then when I pump my milk, another thing, that's what I'm going to get to. When I pump my milk and it stays out, they said milk is supposed to stay good for in the refrigerator for, what, some months, I think, or some weeks. But mine, it separates, of course. But then my milk looks like, um, you know how spoiled milk looks? Like it doesn't, it doesn't remix. I don't know what is going on with that. Um, I'm having that issue. And this oath, a whole, you know, the overall problem is her not wanting to take the bottle. She does not, she do not want to take the bottle. The nine ever like it to suck pacifiers or anything like that. But let me go ahead and cut this video because I need to sit down. Um, I just really needed some help with that. Um, what should I do? You guys have any, you know, any suggestions on what I should do with her taking a bottle, sippy cup? She won't even take the sippy cup. Like, I don't understand it. She just want to breastfeed. And my doctor told me that I can't, um, I can't breastfeed her for three days. Today being the first day. And I don't trust her. I want to take everything, all this medication to get out of my system for, you know, I want to wait a long time. But I'm looking at my bandages in the mirror. But, um, you guys, please, 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 if you have any suggestions that I can do to get her to eat her breast milk, please let me know in the comments. Uh, if you, even if you really have to, uh, go on here, um, contact me through my email if you have to. This is my daughter I'm talking about, so, I mean, if you don't get on there and play on my email, just don't bother, you know. But, um, if you guys would be so gracious help me out this one time because let me know what should I do I like really need your help and I think I'm about to go hit my doctor mama uh niece too off of YouTube and she always helped me on here she always gives good advice to me and I think I'm gonna uh go write her on Facebook right now and see but she always you know tell me what I should do
and it's, um, she always knows what she's talking about. She's like, uh, about 99% accurate <laughs> every time. So, I think I'm going to go write her on Facebook. And, uh, I made the mistake of picking an eye up playing with her because I miss her so much. So I, I haven't, you know, had the time to, like, really play with her. It was like the energy that I've had since I got home. And they have me on a hydrocoding, was it hydrocoding? Cinnamon or whatever it's called. They have me on that, like, I'm like a crackhead right now. <laughs> but, uh, uh, I'm going to show you guys my little incision or my scar, my little tape thing. I'm not taking nothing off. Like one of them I haven't changed, but I just want to show you guys that. Uh, beware, I did have a baby nine months ago. I have really, 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 really bad stretch marks. And yeah, my belly's not that cute. But I'm going to show you guys. Anyway, I'm going to show you guys anyway. Right. The ones at the top right here, I think they had to cut me wider or something because. I was really, really, really bleeding right there, so I had to um, take those out and change it. And I haven't did a belly shot yet since I had my baby, but I, as you guys can see, I have stretch marks extremely bad, but I don't care. Um, that's one incision right here. I have four total, and I have one right here, the lower down by my waist, and then I have uh, one took it out through the navel. Oh, and then I just have these two little sticky things that I'm scared to take off. I don't know what those are called, but I have those two. You know, they be real stuck. I'm scared to take them off. Oh, I can't even laugh. But I'm going to drink me some more water, and um, probably I'm not going to take that pain. I'll be so high, y'all. I'm sitting sit there falling asleep in the bed and stuff. And I had to take out all my jewelry. I snuck into and put some back in because I'm just, I just was a hot band. And my hair, I had to take my ponytail down because I had a silver band up there. But um, they just have my little wristband on that I'm I'm related to the what's the con the contrast dye. And then my little band this one that they left on. And that's the one. And that's where I had my that's where I had my I V at and um it's the band-aid got wet, so I just took it off and put another, or just a regular band-aid. And, yeah, they drew blood and stuff yesterday. Um, my overall thing about lapos laposcopic, I don't, I don't know how to pronounce it, the surgery for dolphins, I woke up and I felt like I just had, uh, octos mama's babies or however babies, you want to say. I felt like I was going to die. I felt like labor would have been better. I, I wanted, I, I'd rather go through labor than to go through the pain I feel after they woke me up. And they gave me, um, they had to give me, uh, uh, what's that stuff called? I, I thought of it earlier. They had to give me, um, they had to give me morphine and all these other pain drugs. It was terrible, y'all. Like I said, I'm over here bumping my gums. Um, I'm about to go uh, type my doctor mom and go, I guess I'll take me some more pain medicine and drink me a whole bunch of water and lay down. But um, I thank you guys for watching and I want to thank all my um, new subscribers and just um, you guys for being subscribed to me. I really, 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 really do appreciate that. Even though I don't have a lot of subscribers, but I'm thankful for the ones I do have. And like I said, I thank you guys for being subscribed. Uh, sorry I haven't been on here in so long. But I just have that emergency if you guys can help me with the breastfeeding question. And I'm going to go get my rest. Stay blessed, and I'll talk to you guys later. All right.